Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video and today we're going to be making some more TikTok outfits in GTA 5 Online. So I've picked out a variety of outfits in this video, different coloured outfits, uh, ones that hopefully you guys do like. Let me know which one is your favourite down below at the end of the video. But yeah, hopefully you do enjoy this video. If you do, I'd really appreciate a like down below as I'd help out massively. Also feel free to subscribe if you're new here. But before we get into the video, shout out to all of these people on screen for commenting hashtag TJRH on my last video. Quickly, if you would like any of these services, be sure to check out Dan Mods in the description below. They offer some of the quickest and safest GTA Cash and Rank services uh, and modded accounts for both the standard edition and enhanced. And as you can see here, they are trusted by hundreds and hundreds of customers. To start off with the video, we have a neon blue outfit right here by X Pro Venom. Uh, so yeah, it's quite a nice outfit, I think. Very simple to do. Uh, well, not really that simple, but you want to come to a clothing store, go to jeans, then go to the Midnight Camo Fitted. Number 41, just up here, the Midnight Camo Fitted. So these here. And then from here, you want to head over to the shoes section. And then on here, go down to Arena War Shoes, go over to the black and blue light ups. So these here, black and blue light ups. After that, you want to go to the top section. Actually, before we do, go on to accessories, go down to gloves, then go for the black armoured. So just one, these ones here. Then go on to designer hoodies, and you want to find the cyan blue hoodie, I think it is. Yeah, so the cyan pullover hoodie, that one there. So just equip this, then go down to utility vest, and then you want to find the blue straps vest. So this one here, the blue straps vest, go for this, and then after you have that, you want to go over to style, then put your hood up, then go to the hat section. Now go on to caps forward, then go to the diamond, I mean the blue sweat box snapback. So this one here, it should match the colours nicely. Uh, then from here, go to glasses. Now go on sports glasses, then head down to the black, actually the Mono Outlaw goggles, so these here, the Mono Outlaw goggles, and then after you have that you want to go to the mask store. Over here just go on to Diamond Casino Heist, then go down to the leather half face masks you want to find a certain one that I pick. So this one here, the cyan leather half face. So it should match the colours, like pretty similar. And then from here go to the, uh, the telescope on the pier. And then over here, run by, spam right on the d-pad you should end up standing still, so open up your interaction menu, equip your, your uh, I think it's a blue sweat box snapback, I'm pretty sure that's what it's called, and then also the mono outlaw goggles, yeah so the blue sweat box snapback, the mono outlaw goggles, and then run away, and everything should merge. Now just put your hood up, and there you go, that's the outfit fully complete, so hopefully you enjoyed, hopefully you like it, uh, I'd rate this a solid 8.3 out of 10, uh, but on to the next TikTok. The next outfit in this video is going to be this red and black outfit here, so it's a really simple outfit again. It looks really good though, uh, so I don't think we made this before. I'm not really sure which top it was. I think it's on, yeah, it's on leather jackets and it's a red racer. So this one here, I haven't used this before, as you can tell. So yeah, it looks pretty good, really bright though. Uh, but from here, you do want to remove a parachute if you have one on. Uh, but go to uh, the pants section, go to arena war pants, and go for the black chain pants, right at the bottom. So these here, and then from here, head over to shoes. And then over here on shoes, go to arena wall shoes, go up to the black and red light ups. So these here, 
the black and red light ups, then head over to accessories. Now gone gloves, then go down to the black woolen gloves. Well I think it might be the black wool gloves. Yeah, so down here the black wool gloves. Uh, and then after you have this, back out of this menu, open up your pause menu, uh, your interaction menu rather, then go to inventory body armor, show standard armor. So just like that you should have the black armor. And then from here, go on to hats. Now from here, go on to combat helmets, and then head down to the black and red quad lens helmet. So this one here, the black and red quad lens. And then from here, go to the glasses section. Also, hold right D-pad to put your visor up as well. So before you do this, put the visor up, then go on glasses, go to the mono outlaw goggles. So these here. And then from here, go down to the mask store. Then on the mask menu, you want to go down to balaclavas and then go for the red knit balaclava. So this one here. Uh, now finally, go to the telescope on the pier. Yeah, so over here, run by, spam right on the D-pad. You should end up standing still. So from here, open up your interaction menu, go to accessories, Go on glasses, and then switch to the Mono Outlaw goggles, then run away, you'll notice it all merges, so there you go, that's the outfit complete. I'd give this a solid 8 out of 10, however, of course, as usual, let me know what you'd rate it down below, uh, but anyway, on to the next outfit. Next up we have another black and red outfit, this time it is using the black joggers, and also the paramedic belt, so I will be showing you everything you need to make this. Uh, they didn't show us how to get the belt, but I'll be showing you how to do that, don't you worry. Uh, but yeah, equip your black joggers if you do have them. If you don't have them, I've shown how to get them plenty of times before. Uh, otherwise, you can just use some black jeans. But yeah, go for the arena wall, uh, black and red light ups. Then go to the top section. Uh, make sure you remove your top. Then from here, go to gloves on accessories. Then go down to the black woolen gloves. So these here. These here. And then from here, go on cuffs and equip the spiked gauntlet on both arms. So right and left. These two here. And then from here, go back to tops, go down to utility vests. You want to go for number 43, the peach plate carrier. So number 43. And then from here, go save this to slot, slot number one. And then from here, head down to Outfits, Heist Coveralls, equip any of the last four, so any of these with a gas mask. Uh, and then from here, you can go to the telescope on the pier. Over here, run by, spam right on the D-pad, and then you should be standing still, so open up your interaction menu. Go to outfit, equip the one you just saved, then run away, and all you need to do is go to the mask store from here. And then over here, you want to save this outfit in slot 1, so overwrite the save. Just save it to slot 1, so overwrite the save. So just do that quickly. And then from here, you want to back out of this menu, and then you want to open up your pause menu. So, back out of this menu, open up your pause menu. You want to go to online, go on jobs, play job, go on to Rockstar Created, and go on versus, actually missions, and start up a titan of a job. And when you load in, you should notice the peach plate carrier has disappeared and you also have the gas mask. 
So from here, go to the ammunition store in the mission. And then inside of here, save this outfit to slot 1, so overwrite the save. And then from here, call a job using your phone. And then from here, in the ammunition store, so go back to an ammunition store, go on outfits, and then you want to equip any outfit you have, the belt that you want to merge on. So I'm going to use this one here as I have the paramedic belt on it. However, you can use any other belt in the game. It's really up to you. But from here, you want to open up your pause menu. Then go to online. Go on to jobs, play job, bookmarked. Then go down to missions and start up its a G thing. So I'll leave a link to this in the description for you to bookmark. And in this menu here, set the clothing to player saved outfits, and then you want to invite anyone and start this up. Now in this menu here, scroll one to the right on the owned outfit, and then from here, ready up. Now in the mission, all you need to do is wait a little bit, so wait a few seconds and then either quit the job using your phone or you can do, uh, what you can do is open up your pause menu, go to online, start up Rockstar Creator, then when you load into that menu, start up a new online invite only session. Then from here, you want to go to your car or a streetcar, doesn't matter. Uh, but what you want to do is register as an MC president or a CEO. So up to you, either one of those, both will work. Then go and sit inside of your car or the streetcar, go to MC or CEO style, switch one to the right, then one back to the left, then get outside. You'll notice you get this outfit, so from here, go and save it. Now if you want you can leave it like this, however what I decided to do was add some body armour. So I added the standard armour, just because I think it looks a bit nicer, but it's up to you. Uh, so save it again if you want to. But from here go to hats and equip the black bulletproof helmet on a bulletproof helmet. And then from here, after you have that, you can go to the mask store. And on a mask menu, go into balac uh, the headscarves, not balaclavas, and go for the red pattern wrapped. So the one I just went for. Or you could go for the dark red, it's up to you really. Uh, but from here, go to the telescope on the pier. And then over at the telescope, run by, spam right on the d-pad. You should be standing still, so uh, after that, you want to go and equip your black bulletproof helmet and then run away and it should all merge. So there you go, that's the outfit done. So I rate it's probably a 9 out of 10. Let me know what you'd rate it down below, but onto the last outfit. The final outfit in today's video is going to be this sweaty all black outfit right here. So yeah, pretty simple to make, but yeah, let's get into making it. You want to start off by coming to a clothing store, then go on to the tops, head down to sweaters. You want to go for the last one, so the black combat sweater. So this one here, uh, and then if you have any utility vests on, just take them off and then head over to the pants section. Now on here, go to the cargo pants, go for one of the black large cargos. So these here. 
And once you have these, you want to head over to the accessories menu at the back right of the store. Over here, go down to scarves and equip the black desert scarf. So this one here, number two. Then go, make sure you have some black gloves on. I just went for the black armoured. But from here, you will want to go onto your hats. Head down to bulletproof helmets. Go for the black bulletproof helmet. So this here. And after this, you want to go to the glasses section. And go for these here, the grayscale urban skis. Then from here, equip a black combat parachute bag, which if you don't have, you can buy from any ammunition store. But from here, go to the mask store. Then on this menu here, go down to ski masks, head up to the skull tactical ski and equip that one. So up here, the skull tactical ski. And then finally, go to the telescope on the pier. And then over here, run by spam right on the D-pad. And from here, equip the grayscale urban skis, run away. And just like that, it should all merge. So there you go. Uh, one last thing though, I did forget to add some boots because uh, they tuck these cargo pants in. Uh, so we will have to go back and add some. So head over to a clothing store. And I can't remember which ones they had on. So just go for whatever ones you want. I went for the charcoal tactical boots, but it's up to you. So there's quite a few. Just go for some black ones. But yeah, there you go. That's just final outfit done. So hopefully you enjoyed. I'd rate this a 7.5 out of 10. However, let me know what you'd rate it down below. But there we go, that's all the outfits done for this video, so I hope you enjoyed at least one of them. Let me know which one was your favourite down below. But yeah, thank you so much for watching, have an awesome day or night, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.